How to Carve Your Candle Using Screwdrivers by Craftopedia. Here I have a candle and some tools of screwdrivers and a brush. Okay, we'll start off. Well, if you know how to make a candle, it's well and good, but if you don't know, you can visit uh, my playlist to know how to make a candle, basics of candle making. So, here you can see, I'm using the sharp point of the screwdriver to make some lines on my candle. I'm using a blonde one to uh, increase that um, carving style. So, I use as many tools as possible uh, which, which are there with you. You can carve any type of design on your candle. I'm just making some vertical lines and um, horizontal lines, all those stuff, but you can make any design. Of course, I'm going to put a video on how to make designs on your candle coming soon. So, okay. I'm making such lights all over my candle and widening them using other blunt tools. Now clean off uh, that all those wax stuff using a good brush so you can see it becomes clean again for you to work. You can make any design on your candle. So um, as you go on doing, you just you can ha increase the pressure which you're keeping on the candle, so that your design gets some height. Means it goes in. So clean off all this excess wax using the brush. If you don't have these screwdriver tools, you can um, use knives, forks, and even anything like uh, unused or dried refills, pens, and pencils, pointed pencils, and of course, a lot of things. You can use all the things which are there in your home, which are pointy, and how um, it's, they can do this work. So you can see I've completed the whole candle, um, making it clean. And of course, even screwdriver tips are very pointy at some time. So please be careful while using pointy screwdriver tools because these are very harmful and dangerous if they get hurt your skin so here I'm making a horizontal one using another type of screwdriver this is the place where you can go wrong means instead of getting a straight line you may get you may just go down or go up you can see it's happening for me also so be very very careful while doing horizontal lines because they can go wavy Now take a big one and start to widen up that design, it's just line. So you see it's quite easy for you to do the candle, means carve the candle. And a small tip is that just as you take out the candle from your mold, um, its edges are quite uneven, pointy and um, not good looking. So you can do the thing is that 
using the same old tools or a knife you can just smooth off the edges both bottom and top of the candle and by using uh, sandpaper if you have you can uh, make a rounded edge so that it also gives a um, really good look for your candle if you really have sandpaper you can um, use it on the whole candle if you do any mistake you can just correct it or smoothen it you can use sandpaper also but make sure that you use a sandpaper which has uh, larger grains now you can see I'm trying to make a band a big uh, band like whole structure using um, a big tool the scraping of a horizontal thick line you can just make like uh, such lights all over the candle or just make some vertical lines horizontal lines or make all vertical lines whatever whatever you like just let your creative mind just go out flying you can make um, some dot like structures on your candle so I'm going to show you that also in this video so you see just give it a good finishing look by scraping and going on scrape your candle So I've made up two such lines and now just view carefully. I'm removing certain parts. Just um, remove a small amount of uh, wax alternatively so that um, you are, you're getting a box like uh, structures. Are you able to see that? I guess you're able. You're getting um, some box like structures on your candle just do it all over the, the candle and of course you can reuse uh, this uh, scraped candle you can see in my straight a lot of uh, wax has been uh, scraped off you can just melt it again and use it in your candle or you can make it as a base I'm going to show you that candle also in which I used all this uh, uh, scraped out wax to make the base of that candle it looked very good I'm going to show you in the next video so just take out the alternative sides of the wax so that you can get such design on your candle How I wish I made the candle using a darker color. If it was made up of any darker color, you can see the design clearly, even I could see. So, here is the completed candle. Isn't it good? Of course, it is. It has to be finished a lot. You may get even um, better candle. So, so, check out some more videos of mine of candle carving. And if you don't know how to make a candle, just visit my playlist and um, view my other carving of candles and please don't forget to subscribe. Goodbye. Thank you.